All right, you're about to watch a video called The Model Explained. I did not do this video. A guy named Brent Gove did it. but So I thought it would be better for you to actually watch um, the master explain uh, what EXP is all about. And and I just there's no real reason for me to recreate what somebody has already done so perfectly. Uh, but, you know, I wanted to give a little bit of a precursor uh, to the video, uh, mainly because those that don't know who he is, um, you, you might not share his same energy and, and passion and enthusiasm. And sometimes it can come off as salesy and pitchy. So I just, I want to just kind of lay that out there is that if there's certain things that you hear about EXP, it's like, oh, here, here comes, here comes another agent attraction pitch, or here comes a revenue share and, and all here, oh, here we're talking about stock again. If those things don't, don't interest you, then just kind of tune them out. And you say, well, if those things don't interest me, why would I come to EXP? Well, cause I think that you need to hear kind of the fundamental things of how this brokerage was built. Um, so you can get a clear picture and understanding um, because other people might be in your ear saying, no, 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 you might not, you might not understand this. I, I'm telling you because that, that absolutely happened to us. Uh, our team leader said, I don't think you understand this. And I don't think you know that. And I said, Hey, well then explain it to me. I, I, I need to know these things. Um, in which the team leader could not explain it to me. So um, this is not a knock on that per se. It's just that I, I, I know that there is a complete misunderstanding when it comes to EXP. And, and listen, it's, their, it's, it's other people's job if they're working at another brokerage to make sure that you stay there. So um, I have no qualms about that, but I do... Um, I, I'm excited for you to watch this and it's going to be about 30 to 35 minutes of your time. It will be well worth it. And I'll interject at points just so you can kind of, you know, so, so we can talk about the finer details of this is I don't want you to miss it. I don't want to miss it for, um, for the, for the, for the future that you may have in real estate that you get five to 10 years down the road. You say, what, what do I have to show for it? And, and I, I think, to me, that is such a sobering thought is to say, what do I have to show for it? And because uh, this year's sales will not pay next year's bills. So I want you to, to, to pay attention to this. Um, and if you have any questions, my wife and I run a real estate team along with our business partner, um, Jeremy Galloway. And, and, and we have a, a group that we're building here. And, and listen, we're, we're ready to pour into you if you have any questions. So uh, without further ado, let's get into the model explained video. And uh, you'll see my face at, at various points on there so we can talk about some more stuff. All right. Check it out. Hello, my name is Brent Gove, and I could not be more excited to share with you this new model for real estate called EXP Realty Worldwide. The success of EXP now has become a multi-billion dollar company, uh, publicly traded on the NASDAQ, and, and its success is basically being undeniable. Everybody wants to know about EXP, so I get the privilege of sharing with you today all about it. Now, before I do, briefly, I'd like to give you some background on me. I promise to be brief. I got started in real estate 25 years ago. I was 30. A little quick math. You know I'm 55. And uh, my first 12 years was at Remax. Wonderful experience. Loved that company. A very positive experience. In 2009, I made the change after 12 years to Keller Williams. And uh, of course, it was just, I, I liked it even more. As no, nothing wrong with Remax, but my experience of Keller Williams was even, even better. I didn't think it could get better than Remax, but it did. Keller Williams was amazing. I put eight years in there. I was a team leader. I ran a large office in California. And then about four and a half years ago, I get a call from a friend of mine telling me all about eXp Realty, all excited, wanting my opinion. Maybe like you, you have a friend who said, give me your opinion about this new model that is going to revolutionize the way real estate is done worldwide. By the way, we're in 19 countries with the filming of this particular business briefing on eXp. But I said, tell me all about it. I knew I would not be interested. That I can promise you. And at the end of this business brief, I'm like, how do I know more? And hopefully that's going to be you. You'll do your due diligence. You'll check it out like I did. So here's the deal. 
The key to every successful business is that special human being that comes along, like a, a Bill Gates or a Steve Jobs or a Richard Branson or a, possibly a, a Henry Ford, that person who comes along and just lights the world on fire. Fire. And that person, of course, is this gentleman, Glenn Sanford. In 2009, he founded eXp and he had an idea about how to do real estate, as many before have. But his company is now the fastest growing real estate brokerage in the world. It's not a franchise, it's a national and international sensation. All right, to interject about Glenn Sanford, uh, once we came over to eXp, I didn't realize how accessible he really is. And so when you think about the leaders of the companies and uh, from where we came, it was was Gary Keller, who's just just an, um, just an absolute phenomenon in, in real estate. But um, when uh, I've attended now a uh, an event, uh, one of the big events through eXp and um, and then there's things that EXP has like workplace, uh, where they do a bunch of communication. Um, and he was all over the place at the shareholder event, which was down in Orlando that we went to. And, and then, um, there was another call that I was on. It was a, like a, like a zoom meeting. And, um, the reason why he was on it is because somebody in workplace reached out to him and said, Hey, can you, can you, um, can you jump on a call with us? And he replied back and said, yeah, I can fit that in. And he's, uh. I mean, it's just really cool to see how how accessible he really is inside this company and how much he cares for the agent. So I'll let uh, Brent continue talking about all of it. Yeah. So what is eXp all about? Well, the best way to explain that to you is the whole blockbuster Netflix. This is a perfect analogy. You take Netflix, they went to Blockbuster, who, by the way, put Hollywood video out of, out of business, and they put together all the mom and pa shop videos uh, co companies out of business. And you know what they did? They said, look, we can deliver the product better, more efficiently to the consumer at the click of a button. And I remember as a consumer thinking, I don't want to watch a movie on my phone or my laptop. I want it on a giant 80-inch screen TV like this. I, I thought Netflix was a terrible idea as a consumer. Well, thank heavens that Netflix didn't listen to me and they tried to sell their idea to Blockbuster. Blockbuster said, we'll pass. We are the six, the 800 pound gorilla in the marketplace. We determined what happens here and they were. They were completely dominant with thousands and thousands of locations worldwide. So they made the biggest mistake of their life and they kind of poo-pooed, put down, said it'll never work. And of course, we all know the end of the story. Within five to six years, Blockbuster was filing for bankruptcy. And then, of course, Amazon. Look what Amazon did to retail worldwide. I mean, the largest company in the world. EXP is now doing this in the real estate world. And it's for the better. It's for you. It's totally for you. And so even this Tony Robbins noticed, uh, Hilton, he noticed that the cloud-based um, model is a superior model. Look, look at Hilton Corporation. Been around for 100 years. And, uh, and then Airbnb. Guy has an idea, kind of like Glenn Sanford. He starts Airbnb. 10 years ago, and the company was valued at $31 billion. Now this slide, this picture is a couple years old. Uh, last time I looked, uh, Airbnb was valued over $100 billion. Pretty amazing. Well, Hilton, they own real estate, very much bricks and mortar, very much a, you know, not a cloud-based company. They're, they've actually, their valuation's gone up to, last time I looked, about $25 billion. But look at that, 10 years versus 100 years. The growth, it, the growth is in the cloud-based sector. Look at Uber, look at DoorDash, look at Zoom. Look, again, we talked about Amazon and Netflix and Travelocity, the travel industry, digital downloads, iTunes, um, you know, you get the idea, Pandora. Life as we all know it is changing. And so, what is this cloud campus environment? Well, yeah, basically there are no desk fees and I paid desk fees for 20 years at the big brokerages. It cuts the overhead of a traditional type of office. We put our money, eXp, into lead generation and technology to support the agent to make a difference. All right, so I want to touch on the, the virtual work side of this and what cloud-based and, and how the office environment actually rolls. And um, to each their own, how they, they really approach this um, of how you work and, and whether you're a home office type person or if you're mainly from your car or, or um, you know, do you actually need a desk at, at an at a office to feel like you're a part of something? Um, so, 
to try to keep this as concise as I can, when it comes to um, this virtual world that EXP, I, I think a lot of competitors um, try to downplay the the whole idea of, of being a virtual brokerage. I feel just as connected being at EXP as I did at my previous brokerage. Um, there are There's actually a greater swath of people throughout the country that I am more connected with than ever before. So the groups that you belong to um, in EXP, it makes it makes really a lot of the difference. And so, yes, there are some people you can align yourself with maybe that don't help as much. And I think but that's true of just about anywhere. Look, look at our previous brokerage when they had a profit share and we had we had a sponsor. That sponsor didn't do anything to help us. Now, was it his obligation or, or you know, so that that really it really kind of comes down to the person and, and how the setup is. But, you know, when it comes to how we work, um, it, it is a it's a, a completely different spin. There's masterminds, there's there's video conferencing, there's so much available to us every week that is inside this cloud. But they also they do a ton of training inside of EXP World, and then there's all the separate training that all the agents put on all the time. So I, I definitely feel just as connected, but it's really based off of my ability and my um, you know where I want to be in terms of of my day in and day out activities. I do think that the office environment is important. So when we talk about Regis, there is an affiliation to Regis and, and, and it really just so you can get the membership to it, but it's not so you can actually have access to a private office. So I don't want you to think that you come into EXP, then there's a Regis in your area and there might not be one, but if there is one, it's really just the membership application to it. Um, so you can go into the building and then not say anything to you about being there. The, but the private offices cost money still. Um, and, and it's probably a comparable rate to some other stuff. But um, so there is that component of it. As an aside, EXP has bought Success Magazine. It's about a 100 old, 100 year old uh, entrepreneur magazine. And they have uh, uh, spun off a couple of different uh, entities from that. And they have lending and coaching. And one of the really exciting ones is going to be the co-work. So they're calling it Success Space. And um, me and my business partner are actually bringing it to Birmingham. And we're going to have, we actually signed on to bring two of them. So if you're in our area, then we're going to be bringing a co-work space to Birmingham before long. And there's a, uh, there's a, um, a few others that are already signed on across the country. And you have Texas, uh, there's a couple of locations in Texas. You have Indiana, you have Long Island, you have Louisiana um, and California. So then there's probably some that I'm missing there too. So it's, it's um, no EXP is not necessarily brick and mortar, but they do understand the value of community and, and, and culture uh, as it exists in terms of the, the whole um, uh, span of the, of the company and how they're going to be built for the future. And um, for them to take on these other projects and things that they're wanting, they understand how the agent needs to work and how they want to work and, and basically give me an option. And so uh, if you want to know more about success space, I'd be more than, more than glad to talk with you about that. So let's move back on to Brent's. So I want to cover this. Everybody thinks if I go to eXp, I'm going to be working from the cloud. No, eXp works from the cloud. They have over a thousand employees worldwide that live in the cloud, work in the cloud. You will work at an office. We have a Regis Alliance and there are 3,000 Regis's and spaces worldwide. I mean, Chicago, Paris, New York, San Diego, San Francisco to Miami, South Africa, Europe, everywhere you go. In Sacramento, where I'm from, there are eight Regis locations. So I didn't lose five Keller Williams offices. I gained three different additional locations, and they're typically nicer beautifully decorated, fully staffed conference rooms. It's amazing. So you will not be working from home. You will have office space and everyone gets a Regis membership at no cost to you to go into a Regis and work in their cafes and their, 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 their places of business, Wi-Fi, coffee, the whole thing. Now, what else do we have? Well, we have four main pillars at eXp. Number one, leads. That's pillar number one. Number two, training world-class training. Number three, stock. This is agent-owned, broker-owned. We own this together. That's a big deal. And finally, number four, because you're an owner, you get to share in the revenues. I knew in my 12 years at Remax, I did not share in the revenues of Remax International or my eight years at Keller Williams. I did not share in the revenue of Keller Williams International. 
And if you're at Coldwell Banker or Sotheby's, you know what I mean? So here's a chance to own the company you work at with the founder and share in the revenues. But let's get down to the first pillar, leads. Because that's really what agents want. EXP has formed a joint venture, a partnership with KV Core. You can Google them, YouTube them, watch some videos on what KV Core is, but it's a, a CRM, a contact retention management for clients, and it produces leads when you learn how to use it. Like a farmer, like someone with an orchard, you want to grow your real estate business. If you're commercial or residential, you want to grow and prosper. And so this CRM through KV Core is incredible and in helping agents dramatically with additional buyer and seller leads in residential and commercial. And so beyond leads, what do agents need? They need training. They need world-class training. And the same great trainers that were at Remax and Coldwell Banker and Sotheby's and Keller Williams, those same great trainers are at, at EXP. The same, it's the same or better. Everyone's so excited. In my opinion, it's even more powerful. So we have world-class training. We have 10 to 15 classes a day in the cloud, 10 to 15 live classes a day. You can raise your hand, ask questions. I've spoken to thousands of people on the EXP cloud campus at one time. And there's, these happen all this, commercial real estate, there's luxury real estate, there's residential real estate, how to build a $100 million sales team, dominate your market with social media, business planning for 2022 or 2023. There's so many great topics and how to learn how to sharpen your ax, how to become more powerful in real estate for your families. And so we have that. We also have live training. We have, uh, this is in Sacramento, California. We've rented some of the largest uh, halls. This is a wedding venue. We packed out with hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of agents and broker associates, and we're training on lead generation. So this is pretty cool. The third pillar is what? It's called equity. Something I didn't have. You know what I had after 12 years at Remax? And I'm grateful for Remax. I had trophies and plaques. Trophies, plaques, recognition, right? Can you relate? I don't know what brokerage you're at. Hey, you're number seven in the region. You're number three in the office. Oops, you moved up to number two in the office. And now you're number one and we're trying to, you know, sell more, do more, be recognized. But what are those trophies? What are those plaques? What is that worth when it's all done and said? You know what I had to show after 12 years at Remax? Nothing. I moved companies. I closed out whatever I had in escrow, which by the way were 37 listings in active escrows. Closed them out. Moved to Keller Williams and that was it. It was like pulling your finger out of a glass of water. <laughs> water just goes back across. It was like I was never at Remax. I had nothing to sell. And that's what it is like for 99% of all agents. Um, I go to Keller Williams, same thing, eight years, won awards, this, that, won trophies and plaques and recognition. When I left, I did have, they have a program called profit sharing. And, um, and so I had a little bit of profit. I think I was averaging $700 a month, in all fairness to Keller Williams, after eight years. And, but we can all agree that $700 a month isn't going to change your life. And I had enrolled 55 agents for Keller Williams because I was a very happy Keller Williams agent. I'm very grateful for Keller Williams, an amazing company. And I literally sponsored 55 agents and said, come to Keller Williams and prosper and grow. And that was generating me 700 a month. And at one point we were the number one office in profit nationwide, Roseville, California. But it was making 700 a month after eight years, just kind of weekend fund money. So that wasn't gonna change my life. All right, so Brent mentioned that there was four pillars. I wanna talk about two of them specifically. One of them is leads and the other one is training. So to talk about leads, I think we need to have a reference point, um, and that would be what CRM are you using? Now, KV Core is the, the CRM of choice for EXP. That, that's at this recording, and that, maybe that could change. I'm not sure. But KV Core is really set up to, to make sure that you have a good way to maintain a database. And it's, and it's a lot like other CRMs out there. Uh, so you'll have something, you'll have a CMS tool when it comes to actually creating and editing your website, you'll be given something more generic and then you can, you know, maybe you have your domain, like my name is Jeff Musser and it could be jeffmusserrealty.com or jeffmusser.com or whatever your brand is. You can bring that into um, to, to the domain side and then you can run your, your website if you were already, if you already had another domain before coming over to EXP. Now, if you say, hey, I don't know what, what you're talking about, you'll be gifted something just, just generic, and it'll probably be jeffmusser.exprealty.com uh, until that changes and, and you decide to kind of 
maybe tweak the the the, the website um, side of things. So uh, so once you have that in place, you'll the the flow um, to your database will be from your website more than likely. Now there's other ways that it can happen, but no, normally the the website is like the storefront, and then as people walk in the door, then they come in. Um, and then the, the capturing of that information is, is in turn kind of the database side of it. And there's all kinds of things that you can do to um, maybe segment and manipulate and do all kinds of things in the database side, which would be like sending emails and sending text messages and, and maybe grouping people in a, in a certain way that you like, like past clients and, and um, buyers in a certain city and, and price points and I mean, really, the sky's the limit on how you actually want to segment it out and then reach those people with drip campaigns and just one-off messages. And, and so all of that can be done in KV Core, again, which you're given through EXP. There's a lot more information to that, and, and this video will probably be a lot longer it, to continue to describe that. But it's, um, it's imperative that you know that, one, you, you have to figure out, like, how do you want to run your business and, and, and KV Core can just supplement that and make your life a lot easier. Um, and so that, that's the CRM side. Now, lead flow can come from all kinds of different places. That would be organic website reach. It could be Facebook ads. You could pay for something you know, crazy like Zillow uh, or realtor.com leads. I think um, EXP has a, a thing with OpCity, which is really just realtor.com uh, leads. Uh, or you can do something called Make It Rain. And so it's just a button you click on inside of your EXP Enterprise dashboard. And that's just, the, just as a side note, the EXP Enterprise is just kind of the, the admin side of the house. So you'll be given a login and you'll be able to get on there and look at you know all your transactions that you've done. You'll be able to reach different places that EXP points you to for revenue sharing, the marketing center. But there's a little button there that's called uh, Make It Rain. And all they are are Google leads. And if you're familiar with that, then you, some people will say, Hey, those are my, that's my SEO stuff. It's not, um, it's not the same way. What people there, there's a pay-per-click campaign that's put out, um, on Google when people type in, like, um, maybe they'll say homes and, and whatever your city and homes for sale in that city. And then things can pop up with advertising that then they click on and then they go to your storefront, which would be your website. So you can set a budget for that inside of Make It Rain and you can get just the constant flow of leads. There's all kinds of things that you can choose and pay for out there. I'm not saying that this is the only one, but they just make it very easy for you to get in and do it. Now, just, just to kind of thread all of that conversation, the, this, the best CRM is going to be the one that you use, whether that's KV Core or anything else. Uh, and Google leads are only as good as the, the person that is maybe contacting them. So we actually get Google leads on our team all the time. And we have a nurture campaign for those people. As soon as they come into our system, they're greeted right away with automation um, from things that sound like us. And then, then we have, it's up to us of actually having a conversation. So um, the, the judgment shouldn't be on whether or not these are good leads. The judgment should be on how willing and consistent you are to act, and, you know, to, to talk to people and, and, and pick up the phone and do all those things. So that's, that's what Brent is talking about when he's saying KV Core, CRM, and leads. And the, the, the whole encapsulation of it is that uh, EXP just makes it easy for you to have all of these things in a very well-established system. All right, let's talk the training aspect of this. And I thought the best way to talk about it would just be to show you how you would get to it um, and for uh, for everything EXP. Now, this does not encompass all of the training because your group can do um, a lot of training and, and the groups that we're a part of, they're always just pumping out uh, new kind of content and different ways to to, to do your uh, to do your job just a little bit better. And um, so that that would be one avenue, but the the main avenue when when it comes to everything EXP would be uh, all the training that they put on and the calendars that they put out for the uh, for the training in advance. So um, one of the ways to get there would be signing into your uh, enterprise system, and so you would once you log in, you would be at this page. You'll scroll down to where you see education calendar, 
and this would be the calendar. Now, all of this training is shown in um, in uh, Pacific time. And so if we scroll down to where we are today, which is, I believe, the 13th. So this is all the training that is happening today. So let's just say Icon Series, should I join a team or introduction to industrial real estate and six tips uh, to kill the competition. Now, when it says Icon Series, that just means that there's an Icon agent teaching the class as part of their requirements as being an Icon agent. So every year when you hit Icon, uh, it's a production-based award. And if you hit Icon, then one, one of the requirements is to teach a class. And it'll say, hey, this, this class is in the EXP University Icon Hall. So let me load up EXP World. It's a software download that'll be on your computer. And so this will be, so I'll just click it um, down in the, uh, the bar of my computer and I have my password saved, I do believe. And as soon as it pulls up, I'll show you what that looks like. Now there's, there's quick ways to get there. You can walk, walk around because it'll tell you that there's a map, but I'll walk away from all of these people and there's, this is what this looks like in this nature walk around the places. So you do not have to walk around. You can just hit go to and you will go to EXP University and then you can go to the Icon Hall and it'll teleport you right there. So here's, here's one. Okay. So let's just say you're going to attend the class. And you can use spacebar and you can look around. So when somebody's teaching a class, they will be on stage and then you will be able to zoom in on the monitor. So as soon as, as you click on these things, it will then become full screen for you. And you will just sit here and listen to the class. And that is one of the ways that you can always just pipe in to, to training. And this training is, as you can see from the calendar, it's happening all the time. But this whole equity piece, wow. Um, let me explain how it works. There are five ways to, uh, to develop equity or stock in EXP, equity, to become an owner. A rising tide rises all ships. Not just when I was at Remax, I watched Dave Linegar become a billionaire. When I was at Keller Williams, I watched Gary Keller become a billionaire. Maybe you were at Coldwell Banker and you watched them sell that to Realogy, a billion dollar hedge fund. Maybe you're a Berkshire Hathaway person and, and you got bought up and who owns that? A billionaire called Warren Buffett. Stop working for billionaires. You know, you're as good as your last sale. How many you got in escrow right now? Three, you got seven. Oh no, you have 19, I get it. No, you have 49. I had 55. I had 55 in escrow at one point. Ask me what I get paid today for that. Nothing, I can answer that. Nothing, whatever you sold three years ago, seven years ago, 15 years ago, you don't get paid today. But if you can own a piece of the brokerage you work at, a significant piece, a brokerage that's going into multi, multi-billion dollar valuations, which we are, look us up. We're publicly traded on the NASDAQ. Last time I looked over $6 billion and I get to be a part of that. That's pretty exciting. So here's how it works. When you close your first transaction at eXp, you get awarded stock. You become what's called a shareholder. You get to share in the equity of eXp with the founder, Glenn Sanford. That's pretty cool. Number two, when you cap, we have a $16,000 cap and an 80-20 split. And then when you cap, you go to a 100% split. Most of our agents who are productive cap in the first month or two or three, which means they're at a 100% split for the next 10, you know, eight, nine, 10, 11 months. I cap what well, we cap in the first month every year. And we're, we're at 100% for 11 months. And the most EXP gets is $16,000. It's like that for everyone. Now, it's not the lowest cap in the marketplace, but it's certainly not the most expensive cap. It's competitively priced. You get a lot of value for your $16,000. Next is when you sponsor people, when you tell people like, and this happens at all companies, if, you, if I were to go to Century 21, people can see, why are you at Century 21? I'm like, oh my gosh, because of this, this, and this. I go, you know what? 
Maybe I could use a change. Do you think your manager would talk to me at Century 21? Sure. Why do I know this? Because this happened to all of us. You could work for Compass. You could work at Sotheby's. You could work at Coldwell Banker. I'm second generation and my kids are third generation. My folks put 55 years in real estate. The last 25 years at Coldwell Banker. And guess what? Marge Anderson referred them to Coldwell Banker in 1983. Ask me what Marge Anderson got paid for 25 years. I'll answer, nothing, zero. My friend, Mike Pushik, my neighbor, went to Remax back in 1999. And within four years, he was selling 330 homes a year. Pretty awesome. Remax was so excited. They're like, Brent, thank you for referring Mike. He's amazing. Guess what? Ask me what I got paid. Nothing. Remax got paid 330 times a year. Now I realize that's a good story, but how many of you referred a friend to your brokerage and they sell 20, 30, 40 homes a year, much more normal? That means your broker got paid 20, 30, 40 times a year. What did you get paid? Nothing. Stop trading the cow for magic beans. The referral of the agent or broker associate into commercial EXP or residential EXP is invaluable. How would you like to get paid almost every single time they sell a house for the rest of your life? That is what EXP is about. That's why people are so excited. So you're gonna, every time you sponsor someone, you enroll someone for EXP, you tell them about it and they join, they say, yeah, I'm here because of Brent, I'm here because of Rob, I'm here because of Cindy or Tom or Karen. You become what's called their sponsor. And when they close their first sale, you get a stock award. My first year, I won 51 stock awards. The previous 20 years, zero. <laughs> I won trophies and plaques and recognition, but that is not worth a lot. Next, we have our Icon Agent Award. And what that is, is when you basically um, cap, you, you cap at 16,000 paid and you do 20 additional sales. For most agents in the country, it means you sell 28 to 30 homes a year. For most agents. Depends upon your market, the price of homes. But most agents means you sell 28 or 30 homes a year. And what happens there is you win a $16,000 stock award. So if you pay in 16, and then you receive a $16,000 stock award, what did it really cost you to be at eXp? I mean, think about that. So our first year, we went to eXp. I capped in a month, you know, because we sell a lot. And then guess what? We did 20 additional sales. And a few months later, we got a $16,000 stock award. And someone said, but you don't know what that'll be worth in three years because there's three years investing on those stock awards. I go, you're right. But I know what the trophies and plaques were worth after 20 years. Nothing. I'll take my chance with this penny stock. Well, during that time, we went on the NASDAQ. We, we became a publicly traded company on the NASDAQ, and the stock exploded. And that stock award became worth, not only was it worth 16, three years later, when I finally invested and I could sell it, it was worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. Pretty cool. Finally, we have our agent equity program. And what the agent equity program is, you can enroll, it's optional, but you can take 5% of every closing and purchase EXPI stock at a 10% discount. Go talk to a financial planner. They go, give me your money. And if you want a you know, medium risk, it should be about a 10% return at the end of your first year. How'd you like to get 10% day one? That is our agent equity program. It's optional, you don't have to do it. I don't know anyone who's not taking a part of that. Then we've just seen this, look at the history of our stock. It's just incredible. It's one of those unicorn moments in the world. It's like that Facebook, that Amazon, that Google moment. And it's in your industry. You're a commercial real estate agent. You're a residential broker or residential agent. This is in your field. This All right, so equity. This is a big thing with me when it comes to, um, really, when it came to us switching over. There, there's, there's a massive amount of opportunity in this company alone. But um, aside from revenue share, the component of being a shareholder in this company is, is mind-blowing. And how much that EXP will reward you for just doing the normal things that you would do Anyway, it has sale houses, and I, 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 I flat out know that we um, probably generally do not understand the stock market. Uh, I think we we know just some just the the rhetoric around it. We know just some 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 theoretical type stuff. We we just know certain things, but we don't really understand it. And so when they say, "Hey, this company will give you a stock," it becomes one of those. Um, like, yeah, I get it, but I just want to sell houses. Uh, and it's like, yeah, but we're, they're going to give you an extra, uh, just for doing it anyway. And just for producing and for, and really, if you hit the highest level of things, you, you, you max, you maximize it. So 
you can you can earn um, through production and you can buy it on each commission. And so you can choose to participate in the agent equity program. Uh, well, you'll buy it at, um, at a 10% discount. So 5% will come out and then they'll give it to you at a discount. I think about this as some relative, somebody that you might know uh, that puts aside money for you and, and says, hey, at the end of this, you will get X amount. Um, but I'm gonna I'm gonna put it away into it to a winner account, and then you will you will be able to touch this one day, uh, just not right now. Think of it in that aspect, and 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 it kind of makes a little bit more sense uh, for the for, for the people that maybe were close to us that we were fortunate enough to have those people in our lives where maybe they bought like they put money away in in like a Coca Cola stock or something like that. It's always it's just a safe it's a safe bet for for most. But you're talking about a company that is growing at a very very rapid pace um, that is very integral um, in inside of the real estate uh, world. And so it is um, it is astronomical what those figures can get to. And I'm going to do another video just on the calculator just to show you exactly what I'm talking about. But uh, so don't gloss over the fact of of, of how big this could be for you. Um, and, and we can talk about the, the, the specifics around what it means to Icon and, and how, what the vesting periods are and um, all of that. And, and it's just, it, it's so huge. The opportunity is so, so huge. This is for you. And so finally, we have revenue share. Now what revenue share is, it's what got me excited. The two the truth, everything I've told you, I wasn't excited about. Everything I just told you, I went, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that seems nice. But I wasn't, I wasn't, uh, fired up. I wasn't like, it didn't ring my bell. This blew my mind. Literally, I couldn't even sleep. So let me explain to you what Revenue Share is all about. We have a seven tier system that our founder, Glenn Sanford, copied from Keller Williams. If you, Keller Williams is the largest real estate company in the world, they have a seven tier system that they do profit sharing through. And if the office is profitable, you can get some profit share. Well, I had referred 55 people who they told people and they told people to take over for seven tiers. I had hundreds in what's called my profit sharing tree and it was paying me 700 a month. Okay, something made, almost made my car payment. And I was like, cool, this is great. Um, when I referred over 100 people to Remax in my 12 years, because all your, if you're going to do well in real estate, your family, friends, and relatives want to get into real estate, and they, they go, can I work at Remax? I'm like, sure. I sent 100 people to Remax in my 12 years, easily. I got three $10 Starbucks cards. Three! If you're going to do well at Sotheby's, or Compass, or Realty One, or HomeSmart, wherever you are, your family and friends will join and you will probably get paid not much of anything forever. Again, stop trading the cow for magic beans. You know what's worth so much more than a million dollar listing? It's the agent that produces millions of dollars in sales every single year. And you give it away for free. Like, here you go. Take my friend Tommy. He only sells 18 homes a year. What's he doing in sales? Oh, he's doing about five, six million a year in volume. Uh-huh. And then whatever brokerage you sent Tommy to, they get paid on five to six million dollars worth of volume year after year after year after year. And you get paid a big thank you from the sales manager. Man, we love Tommy. I'll bet you love Tommy. I'll bet you love him. And so here's a chance to be compensated from that. EXP believes you should be compensated. So here's how it works. This, this middle column here is worth, it's, it adds up to the $16,000 cap. Our founder, Glenn Sanford, said, I'm gonna carve off the first $2,800 if you refer an agent and they cap, which in most markets means you sell seven, eight homes a year, that's it. The national average agent sells like six. So it's a little bit over the national average to cap typically. You'll receive $2,800. What happens if they only do half a cap? Well, then you get half of the $2,800, you get $1,400. What if they sell one or two homes, like a quarter cap? Then you get a quarter of this, $700. So they sell a home, you get paid revenue share the next month. Every month on the 22nd, you get paid revenue share. Month after month after month as that agent is at EXP. I refer to agents four and a half years ago, there are most of them, 90% of them are all still here. And I still get paid, not from the agents. When I had the team, I got paid from my agents, 50, 40, 30%, but I get paid from EXP, from their 20%. We have an 80, 20%. They share back to me how much up to 2,800 per agent. Let me give you a simple example. Someone asked me, he said, well, what if I told 10 agents about this? 
Well, and they all capped. Yeah, they all sold seven or eight homes. I mean, these aren't even highly producing it. They're not even making a living. If you did that, you get 10 times 2,800, which is $28,000. Well, that's not that much money. If I live in the New York or Manhattan or San Francisco, I can earn $28,000 and sell a house. Yep, but can you do this? If those agents stay next year, EXP pays you again. So you mean I get 28,000 the first year and 28,000 the second year? Yes. So now you've received $56,000 for referring 10 agents. What if they sell the third year? You get it again. The fourth year, you get it again. So when do I stop getting it? Never. It's written into our charter. If they stay 10 years, you would get $28,000 a year for 10 years, which is $280,000 for referring 10 capping agents. Again, in most markets, it's seven to eight sales. The average home price is around $400,000, you know, and so it's, you know, maybe seven to eight sales. I know in the Bay Area, it's one or two sales in certain places where the home is San Diego and different places. It could be two, three sales to cap. Now, let's keep going. So let's show you how this works. Let me show you a five-year example of how this works. Now, keep in mind, every agent they tell, you tell five or 10 agents, they will begin to tell agents. You can't stop them from telling agents. This is how Coldwell Banker became Coldwell Banker. This is how Century 21 became Century 21 and Keller Williams and Sotheby's and Compass. If you like your brokerage and people are going to say, how do you like it? Like, I like Compass. It's great. And they join Compass. How are you compensated? CDXP, we have what's called compensation for contribution. If you compensate to the uh, growth of this company, you are going to be, if you contribute to the growth of the company, you're going to be compensated. So here's how it works. Everyone you tell is your tier one. Everyone they tell is your tier two. Everyone they tell is your tier three, four, five, six, and seven. Keller Williams created this 25 years ago. They've been doing profit sharing for 25 years, except their offices lately, you know? I mean, you know, if you worked there, you know what it was. I told you what mine was. So watch this. Let me give you an example. If you tell five or more agents, it unlocks tier two. If you tell 10 or more agents, it unlocks tier three. 15, 20, 25, it grows in increments of five. And then when you get to uh, 40, it unlocks the seventh tier. So let me show you what happens when you just get paid on two tiers, two tiers. So it's our, a five-year example. You may do this in three years. You may do it in 10 years. It's just an example. I did it in six months. Again, this is an example. What I'm going to show you, I personally did in six months. Let's say it takes you five years. Let's say you tell two agents a year for the next five years. How many of you personally told? Ten. You're now receiving $2,800 per agent. Tell agents you sell at least seven or eight homes a year that they're capping agents. You'll get the full $2,800. I didn't even talk to agents unless they sold 10 homes or more a year. So I made sure that I was getting paid $2,800 on every one. 10 times $2,800, there's the $28,000. Remember I said if they stayed for 10 years, that'd be $280,000. What I didn't tell you is they will tell other agents. Let's say the 10 that you sponsor here, that they tell 10. And if they all tell 10, and by the way, I told 10 in my first two or three weeks, and they all told 10 in six months. So it doesn't have to take five years. But let's say in your case, these 10 agents each tell two agents a year. Five years later, how much will they have told? 10. It's a pretty dialed back conservative analogy. Well, guess what? 10 agents times 10 is 100 agents. Every agent on your tier two is worth $3,200. $3,200. So if you have 100 there, that's 320,000 plus your 20, that's 348,000 a year. So I was 51 years old. I owned real estate. I have stock, stocks. I have different investments. I had nothing giving me 348,000 a year cash flow to retire. What is your 401k? When can you just take a breath and not work so hard? I haven't had to sell real estate in three years. I've been able to retire because of this model. So guess what? I'm showing you how to make $348,000 a year. By the way, I ended up telling over 40 my first year. So I was able to do this, and if you take four times this amount, it's a million three nine. It's almost 1.4 million a year. And my second year, I earned $1.2 million. So I told 40, not limited. You could do as many as you want. As a Keller Williams team leader, I recruited 177 in one year, not 10. Think, but that's you, Brett. You seem to be able to talk on camera. You seem to be able to present this. What if I help you? What if you hit press play? Well, this is a recording. I shared a video very much like this by a gentleman named Rob Flick. And I would press play and watch because I wasn't able to present it yet. And all, I shared it with eight of my friends as a beta test. This is what I call a save me beta test. And I recommend you do the same thing. Eight of my best friends, 
All of them sold their franchises, quit their jobs as general managers for Remax franchises and general managers for Berkshire Hathaway, sold franchises, which shall remain nameless, but they sold them, big franchises you would know. Top producers, eight for eight, all came to eXp. Do a beta test, show this to people. Two additional points about eXp that it's amazing is number one, about a year and a half ago, Glenn passed the 50-50 initiative. And what the 50-50 initiative is, he guaranteed that half of all the revenues of eXp would go back to the agents in the form of revenue share. So at two billion, a billion goes to a company, a billion to the agents in the form of cash, spendable money, revenue share. When we hit 10 billion, and we will hit 10 billion, five billion to the company, five billion to you, to myself, to the commercial and residential agents and brokers. It's gonna be amazing. That is the 50-50 initiative, very powerful. We're super excited about that. Now, one more thing regarding the $16,000 caps. I came, I had buying agents that worked for me, showing agents. I also had some listing specialists that worked for me that took the listings that I, I couldn't handle, that were far away, or maybe I just didn't wanna deal with. So if you have, if those of you out there that are watching this, or you're a brokerage and you have a team, it's half a cap. So your agents, all of my agents get to come over on the $8,000 cap. And they all cap in the first month or two, but now they get health care through EXP. You gotta pay for it, but it's a huge reduction. You get stock awards, you get revenue share, you get all the benefits, 10 to 15 live classes a day, and your agents are only paying 8,000 a year. Now, if you have a large brokerage team and, and of over 10, Maybe you have 20, maybe you have 40. I just brought on 200 agents and brokers this past week. Myself, over 200 in one week. We see this all the time now. I'm 1,000 in Poland, 800 in Nigeria. International growth, we're about to open those countries. We're looking at opening those countries. They get to come, if you're a large team, at 4,000 an agent, a quarter cap. So if you have a team of 25 agents, they pay $4,000. They'll, they'll pay it 80-20 split on a deal or two. They're capped and they get all the benefits. They're not treated less than, like uh, they don't get stocked, they don't get revenue share. They get stocked, they get revenue share, they get all the benefits you and I get. But it makes it affordable for a large brokerage like yourself or a large team like yourself to come to eXp and it, it makes it all work. And so who do you talk to? Anyone in the world, anyone. Uh, today, I have agents in all 50 states, every province of Canada that we're in, and 19 countries. Do you know that you know people who live in Israel? You know people who live in Portugal and Germany and Brazil and Colombia and Panama and Australia? I have agents all over the world. You could have the same thing. What's the potential growth for EXP? Well, I believe in the next eight years, we'll open an additional 80 countries. We're in 19, 81 countries will bring us into 100 countries. Worldwide, they say there's 208 industrial nations, I believe is the number, and approximately 25 million agents and brokers worldwide. Nobody has the exact numbers, but if you dig around, you kind of come up on this 25 million. India, for example, has 2 million agents alone. The US and Canada have 2 million licensed agents and broker associates, commercial and residential, alone. So in 208 countries, there are about 25 million. I believe that in the next Eight years, we're gonna have a million agents in 100 countries. Right now, there are 66,000 of us. To put that in perspective, I don't think you get this. Remax, which is an incredible company, it took them 20 years to get to 20,000. Keller Williams, which is an amazing company, it took them 19 years to get to 20,000. EXP just went from 1,200 to 66,000 in four years. I'm telling you, EXP is going to change real estate as we know it worldwide, just like Uber changed the taxi cab business and Airbnb is changing the way people find a place to sleep at night and, and DoorDash is changing the way people get food and uh, Pandora and iTunes is changing the way people get their music and Travelocity and Truvago is changing the way people get their airline tickets and their travel. The world is changing, it's going digital. Don't be stuck in a vinyl record cassette tape world. You need to change with it. You've got to change with it. When Henry Ford invited the Model T, there were, there were I think, 600,000 horse and buggy drivers, and they were upset about the technology of that Model T, and it would backfire and scare the horses. But you know what? The automobile changed the world. Do not be afraid of technology. Embrace it. It is a good thing. So. Here's a summary of what AXP is all about. We have no desk fees, no royalty fees, and no franchise fees because guess what? We're not a franchise. 
I worked for two of the biggest franchises in the world my first two decades. Decade after decade, I paid desk fees. Decade after decade, royalty fees and franchise fees. No more. EXP is a national and international real estate company. We just have a simple 80-20 split. Now, some of you are going to, I'm on an 80-20 split. I have 80-20 right now. Who do you work for? Berkshire Hathaway? Sotheby's? Century 21? Which franchise is it? Coldwell Banker? Oh, it's, you name whatever one it is. Okay. What about that franchise fee of 6%? It's the same thing. Even right now, you're going, oh, yeah. So really, you're on an 80-20 with the office, but a 6% typically will get paid out to the franchise. You're really on a 74-26. 26% of every check you get goes back to the big brand. You don't need the brand. You think you need the brand, you don't need it. At eXp, I broke all my sales records here, and it's an 80-20 split, no six or 6.9 or 6.7% franchise fee, just an 80-20. You're gonna make more on every sale for your family. This is about your family. The cap is 16. Once that's paid in, you go to 100% split right here. Where are the startup costs? What are the standard fees? Well, it's a $149 startup fee one time. I paid that four and a half years ago. 85 a month is our cloud brokerage fee. You get a Regis membership. You get a SkySlope. You get Breakthrough Broker. You get a database system called KV, KV Core, a database and lead generation website. You get email. You get access to the cloud, the 10 to 15 live classes a day. Do the math on that. That's 40 to 60 classes a week. And, um, and then e &O, it's $40 per sale for your e &O. For commercial, it's a little bit more. I think it's $250 a commercial transaction. But for residential, it's $40 and capped at $500 a year. These are the fees. So as we close today, let me ask you a question. Where are you going to be in five years? What are you going to be doing? Commercial real estate, residential real estate, luxury real estate. You're going to be selling 40 homes a year, 80 homes a year. I know for myself, I was 51 years old. I knew that in five years I'd be 56 and I'd just be out there going on more listing appointments, going on more, you know, working with my team. And it was great, but I, I didn't have an option. I didn't have an exit strategy. And without a dream, you can't have a dream come true. Without a plan, then you plan to fail. Nothing's going to change. You've been doing this for 10 years, 20 years, 30 years. Enough is enough. I want to challenge you. Do your homework on eXp. Watch this webinar again. Someone's watching this with you right now. Go to your best friend, your best buddy in real estate, and watch this with them and get their opinion. I did that eight times, and two of them were franchise owners. They sold their franchises. Two of them ran big, big brokerages for, uh, one was a general manager for Remax, another one a general manager for Berkshire Hathaway. They quit their jobs. Every single one of them, big stars in real estate, they all eight for eight came to eXp. Show this to them. Say, I need you to save me from making a mistake. Do a save me beta test. I wish I'd done it 18 times. But go do that. And then once you, you decide I'm ready, go to join.exprealty.com and apply. Apply. Go through the application. What's the application? It looks like this when you get there. Right here. Some basic information. Within a day or two after getting checked out, EXP is going to send you an approval letter. They, what they won't do is they're not going to move your license. You have to move your license. They're also not going to contact your broker. They are not going to contact your broker. It's very private between you and eXp. But make sure you do this because when you're ready to join eXp, it usually goes like this. Okay, I'm ready. I'm listing two homes. I have a buyer. I'm writing an offer today. What happens is it takes two or three days to go through this process. And what happens is those listings get stuck at your old brokerage. That buyer gets stuck at your old brokerage. That could have been half your cap. So instead of you know being at eight, you you know, it's like your cap turned into a $24,000 cap from 16. So make sure you get this out of the way, prepare for success. And then finally, look at this. Our company is going global. We went on the NASDAQ. We became a publicly traded company. We joined Cisco. We joined Intel. We joined PepsiCo and Apple and all these massive, unbelievable companies on the NASDAQ. And we turned into a multi-billion dollar company. That's your company. It's not Gary Keller's company or Warren Buffett's company or, or Rilogy that owns, uh, what, Coldwell Banker, Sotheby's, Century 21, Better Homes, and 24 other brands. This is your company. You get a piece of it. You're going to build equity like a homeowner who buys a home or someone who buys a building and you develop equity. This is it. That's what we tell our clients. Why are you not doing this? So I cannot wait to meet you someday. And um, this was a very exciting day for us a year and a half ago, two years ago, when we hit the closing button on the NASDAQ. We shut down the financial markets worldwide.
wide. It's an honor. They gave Glenn Stanford, America's newest billionaire. But guess what? While Glenn became a billionaire, many of us became millionaires. That had never happened before. So I challenge you, check out eXp. Once we pass the test, join us. We'd love to have you with us. I cannot wait to meet you. Get back with the person who had you watch this and say, tell me more about eXp. Do your homework. Do not miss this opportunity. This is a life-changing, world-changing, seismic shift in the way real estate's being done worldwide. Join us. There's 900,000 agents coming worldwide. Your timing couldn't be better. All right, so there's so much there to unpack. It's, it's, it's just too hard to put everything you need to put in, into a video that, that tries to fully encapsulate what eXp is about. Uh, we actually watched this video when we came over to eXp. Uh, and so, uh, it, you know, if you have any questions about some of the finer details that we didn't, you know, maybe the, where I didn't pop in or something, I'm happy to have an explore phone call with you. Uh, if it was somebody from our group that brought you in, then, then let's have a further conversation. Yeah, I, I know sometimes, you know, we just weren't ready to hear it when we knew about eXp. It wasn't until somebody that at eXp uh, or that, that came to eXp that left uh, Keller Williams that we actually started taking notice, somebody that we respected. And um, so I, sometimes it takes that, but if you have found us through through other methods, you don't, maybe you don't know us and um, that that's okay, but we're, we're, we're here to help answer any questions that you may have. And uh, we, we run a pretty high level business here through eXp. And, and, and I think really it is one of the best models out there. So, if you if you're ready to have a phone call or if you're ready to kind of go through some of the next steps, then then we are absolutely um, here for you and would be honored to to walk you through that. So um, please feel free to reach out uh, to whoever brought you here or if you want to contact me directly.